And we'll start with Jeff Ferrato. Jeff, go ahead. Yeah, Marquez, um, can you talk about uh, how you guys were able to generate such a good pass rush today? I think you had six sacks between you. Yeah, I think it just started off with us, um, with us during the week in practice. We knew that we wanted to get after these guys. Um, we were trying to really attack their offensive line. And so we kind of game planned and started to implement more third down pressures and uh, guys just brought great energy. But in order to have good sacks, you have to have good guys on the back end like Elijah Hicks and Daniel Scott. So they made our job much easier. Uh, Colorado has not been a great offense this year, but with what you saw today from your defense, do you feel like this is something that you can carry forward the rest of the season, this kind of performance? I think so. I think it's hard to win, and um, any win is um, good for us to move forward. So it, I think it's something that we can build off of and just win out the rest of the conference. So, yeah. Thanks. Okay, move on to Trace Travers. Yeah, Marquez, uh, Coach Wilcox said you guys had the pass rushing package in the pocket for a while but hadn't gotten to use it. How was it finally getting to get out there and use it? It felt really good. Um, again, we knew that we needed, we needed to get after these guys up front. Um, we worked on the, the package all week, and uh, it felt really good. It felt good to see the interior guys, our, our, our big boys, get after the QB um, as well. So it was really good. Fantastic. Thank you. OK, Steve Kroner, go ahead. Because I think sometimes people from the outside will think, you know, when, when a team has gone through a rough stretch the way you guys have, that that certain players have to make speeches to inspire their teammates to keep going. But in reality, that's not necessarily the case. Were there any speeches in the past week about, you know, not keeping your head down and, and plowing forward? Or was that not ne not needed to be said? I don't think it was needed to be uh, to be said. I mean, um guys weren't making too many speeches at all. I think we all kind of moving forward, we should have the run and hit mentality. Just when you step on the field, it's like a, a switch that turns on, um, but that switch doesn't start during the game. It starts in practice. So um, I think that's the mentality that we took into the game. Thank you. Okay, any additional questions? Okay, that should do it.